the largest data centers in the world could be coming to West Jordan. And the company behind it appears to be one of the best-known tech companies in the world. But as new specialist Andrew Adams learned, not everyone is sold on the deal, which is awaiting final approval. Andrew? Well, Dini, one of the concerns is water. I mean, how much water do you consume in a giving day? Drinking it? watering the flowers. Well, I'm told this data center at its peak per day would use the same amount of water as 25,000 people. Still with the downsides come the upsides. We have a lot of space to go west. Meet West Jordan's field of dreams. That'll be 1,050 acres. Wildflowers, see ya. It's time for the future. Is the glare gonna get you? City manager Mark Palish is eyeing a shiny new business park here. And at its core, a data center. I'm told that once complete, it'll be the largest data center in the world. The largest. The power is about 180 megawatts at full build out, and that's about three times as high as the NSA facility. A huge data center for a huge company. I think anyone who really knows who the name is would say, absolutely, let's do it. KSL and the Deseret News learned through public records the company may in fact be Facebook. The social network is named in a request for an expedited service contract filed by Rocky Mountain Power last month. My concern first and foremost is the size of the incentive that would go back to the company. Roughly $240 million in total, says so Salt Lake County Mayor Ben McAdams. It's one of several concerns he penned in a letter to the governor, from the amount of water the center will use to the number of jobs it's expected to create just 70 to 100. I worry about uh, that we, we're we taken advantage of. McAdams has a say. He's one of eight votes on the deal. We feel that we have the votes to move it forward. Palace doesn't seem worried. He believes if West Jordan builds it, other businesses will come. I envy Lehigh. Look what's going on down there. Can't even move without a new building going up. And we would like to do that for our city as well. A statement from Facebook says the company isn't committing to anything yet. It's just exploring potential sites Meanwhile, this plan, which is cryptically being described as Project Discus, could be ratified within the next two to three weeks, I'm told. Back to you. Andrew Adams at this late hour in West Jordan. Thank you, Andrew. Mike? Some big news in northern Utah today.